Hi guys! Welcome to my channel! This is Jen Faith and today I'm going to taste snacks. I'm going to taste snacks I get from 7-Eleven. It's my first time tasting this one and I don't know if it's yummy or not or am I going to buy a bunch of this next time or who knows. Okay, first we are going to try this crispy veggie tempura. I love tempura. I love the crunchiness of it. So I bet uh, this this one is delicious and also nutritious. So let's try. But wait a minute. Their ingredients are this oyster mushroom, Asiatic pennywort um, oil, has salt, tempura flour. Juice, ear, mushroom, carrot, and spicy flavor. I love spicy flavor. As long as there's a word spicy, I'm I'm really addicted to anything spicy. So let's try it today. This was established since 1979. Oyster mushroom farm on Patalung in south of Thailand serve you high quality product by secret tempura flour where the value meets delicious okay let's try if it's true delicious and no nutritious so the very important part, no msg mm. i'm not really fond of the smell of this one but okay, let's try. What's this? Yeah, it's a little bit spicy and somewhat there's lemon. Mm. And it says you could also. Use this one as toppings on noodles mm. or mix in salad. It's green and color and tempura flour. I think it's leaf. A leaf. Yes, I love this one. Oh, I see. This is juice ears mushroom. I said that I eat something green, so that I bet this is a shabby pennywort. Mm. This one is mushroom. Oh, oyster mushroom. I love mushrooms. Good. Then this one, carrot. Mm. I think I haven't yet tasted this juice ear mushroom. Where is it? I couldn't identify so so far um, my favorite among this veg veggies is the oyster mushroom I love the taste of it yeah next we have this spicy dried mango Let's try this one it's ready to eat it's good for every occasion like birthday or gift for your friends you can add this one so like this it smells good mm. Mm. it's really spicy it 
So those who aren't into spicy things, the spiciness of this is too much to bear. But for me, it's fine. Mm. You can taste mango, a kind of sour mango. There's salt and dash of chili. It's good, but I, I don't think everybody can take the spiciness of this snack. It's burning my tongue right now. Next, we have this super spice. So, if this one is spicy, Super spice. So let's see. Tamarind plum flavor. Here the picture you have the tamarind and the plum. One thing I can say, the tamarind here in Thailand are sweet. Maybe in Philippines I haven't tried the ripe one because as long as we can see tamarind, it we really we really felt that all tamarinds are sour. That's what we add on our sinigang, right? So, here in Thailand, I think I'm gonna show you a, a clip of it. I'm tasting the tamarind and it tastes so sweet. So, I just only tasted it here in Thailand. So, here's, here it is. Let me taste. Mm. I think I like this better than mango. There's, um nice combination of sweet and sour it says super spice but actually it's not this one is spicier it's more spicy for me than this super spice summary plum flavor i like it mm, good appetizer so this one you can buy this one in 7-eleven for I'm not mistaken, 39 baht or 49 baht, equivalent to about 1.25 dollars. This one is 20 baht, but less than one dollar. And this one too, you can buy this one for less than less than one dollar so additionally if you want to taste or experiment new taste for your tongue these are good and you can eat this one while watching movie or chatting with your friends or in every occasion so yeah okay i hope you have fun watching this video and eating the tamarind so if you like this kind of video I'm going to search for more unique unique snacks to introduce to you if, if you like this kind of video please give this video a big thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time bye